Beyond the wood, the strings, and the player, there's a small, unassuming component that's at the very heart of it all, the electric guitar pickup. Today, we're going to pull back the curtain and dive into the two most critical measurements you can make to understand a pickup's character. First, let's talk about DC resistance. Imagine electrical wire as a highway for electricity. DC resistance is like the amount of traffic on that highway when cars, the electricity, are all going in one direction. DC current. The more the traffic, the less flow of DC current. It's known as ohmic resistance and is a static value that's measured in ohms on a multimeter. This is probably the most common measurement that you'll see in a pickup specifications from the manufacturer and is a straightforward way to gauge the total length of the wire coil inside the pickup. More wire means a higher DC resistance. Measuring it is simple. We're using a multimeter set to measure resistance in ohms. We just connect the probes to the pickup's hot and ground leads. The number we get is a direct reflection of how many turns of wire are on the bobbin. So why does this matter for tone in your guitar? Generally, a higher DC resistance means a higher output voltage. This is because more turns of wire translate to a stronger signal being sent to your amplifier. But it also affects the resonant frequency or tone of the pickup. A higher DC resistance pickup will typically have a lower resonant peak, which often translates to a thicker, warmer, and sometimes less trebly sound. The resonant peak is the specific frequency at which the pickup produces its strongest output. A higher resonant peak means the pickup is most sensitive to and emphasizes higher frequencies. This translates to a brighter, more trebly, or clear tone. The other crucial measurement is inductance. An electromagnet is a permanent magnet wrapped in a coil of very thin wire. An electric guitar pickup is an electromagnet. When you play a guitar string, the vibration of the string disrupts the magnetic field created by the permanent magnet in the pickup. The vibrating string creates a changing magnetic field. This changing magnetic field generates a small alternating electric current in the coil of wire. The small alternating current produced is called electromagnetic induction. In short, induction or inductance is the key electrical property of the pickup's coil that allows it to convert the mechanical energy of the vibrating string into the electrical signal that is then amplified and sent to your speaker. A pickup with higher inductance will generally produce a stronger signal, which will most likely result in a louder, fatter, and possibly darker tone. Conversely, a pickup with lower inductance will produce a weaker signal, often leading to a brighter and clearer tone. Inductance measured in Henry's. To measure inductance, you need a specialized LCR meter. We connect it just like we did with the multimeter. The readings we get give us a much more accurate picture of the pickup's actual tonal character. 